It's day one and 156 golfers from almost 30 countries have been playing their opening rounds in one of the most important and prestigious open championships in golf. Some are champions on the European Tour, some are enthusiastic pros looking for a breakthrough, and some are still just amateurs setting out on their own golfing journey. Although the early starters had the better conditions, there were excellent performances throughout the day with Southern African Haney Otto taking the clubhouse lead. His perfect round of lying under par 63 was packed with 7 birdie as well as an ego 3 at the par 5 eighth. Yeah, I mean I played really well today. Um, first of all, um, I saved a good par and I think that gave me momentum. And then after that I hit it really close. And I must say, it's, uh, I broke 30 putts this week, and um, yeah, I think uh, 23 putts with a chip in makes a big difference. The two highest ranked golfer here this week also both scored well, with Australian Bernd Wisberger birdieing the closing hole to take sole possession of second place. He managed no fewer than eight birdies in his 7 under 65. While Juiced Lewiton from Netherlands is just two shots further back following a fine 67. One of the highlights of the day was a superb holding one from Swede Richard Kalberg at the beautiful par 3 16th. His perfect 7 iron from 201 yards won him a magnificent Volvo XC90 T6 Kinetic valued at RMB 738,800. There are no fewer than 36 Chinese golfers in the field this week. And the best home performance of the day came from one of those who had earned his place via one of the four pre-qualifying tournaments. Yuan Tian recorded a 4 under 68, while defending champion Wu Asun, who was out early this morning, carded a steady 1 under par. 20-year-old Li Haotong, who also finished well in this event last year, had a fine round of 69 to finish at 3 under. At the end of day 1, there are 12 homegrown golfers at par or better. After a long but very entertaining opening day's play, it will be very interesting to see which of the leaders can build on their strong studs and who will emerge from the chasing pack to challenge at the top.